Governor of Fondo State, Toluwaru Simakirudolu, has called on public-spirited individuals and corporate bodies with capacity to intervene in bridging the gap in public health institutions in the state. Governor Kirudolu made the call at the inauguration of the upgraded Millennium Eye Center building at the University of Medical Sciences Teaching Hospital, Akure. Ayode Jamoradio has more. Eye experts say inappropriate attention to eye problem could result into blindness or visual impairment. This is why people aged 40 and above are advised to do routine eye evaluation so that avoidable causes of vision impairment can be picked up and corrected before it becomes a problem. This fear is about to be addressed in Nondo State with inauguration of the upgraded Millennium Eye Center building at the University of Medical Sciences Teaching Hospital at Kure. The building was renovated and upgraded by the Lions Club International Multiple District for, for Nigeria. Vision, as we know, plays a critical role. The Narotimi Akredolu inaugurated the building explained that vision plays a critical role in every facet and stage of human lives. Governor Akredolu said government alone cannot effectively address all the socio-economic challenges in a country, no matter the amount of revenue accruing to its coffers. Our employment cannot be prevented. It cannot even be treated. It can be corrected if timely assessed. If there is a timely assessed to quality eye care and rehabilitation. That's why, but now you see, even two eyes, you cover it, and after some time, you start seeing again. It's no, it's no more than that. Earlier, the grant administrator of the project, Olumi Iwa Jagada, appreciated the all round support provided by Governor Kredolu and other government officials which led to successful completion of the project. The eye care services will now wear a new look in terms of scope and capacity due to the nature of equipment coming on board. The most daring in this regard is the laser equipment, which number has to be increased to two. This is arguably the first time ever this kind of equipment is being domiciled in, 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 on those states, and it is the one that gives glaucoma patients some semblance of hope. With this inauguration, it is hoped that the people of Undo State will have access to good eye care. Ayodejimora Deyo, TVC News, Akwe.